Danielle, you had a very successful career in both freestyle and Greco. What's it like to try and transfer those over? Uh, just, you know, uh, eclectism, I would say, you know, and uh, capability to adapt uh, to both styles. I will compare uh, Greco and freestyle as a uh, uh, rock and roll and classical dance. <laughs> so. <laughs> so, dancing their way to the final here. Riza Kailab of Turkey, he's the big man in red against Mayan Lopez from Cuba. There's Kailab on his way in, four times European champion. He's been ranked number one for the last two years. He beat Lopez in the world final in Istanbul in 2011. So the Turk has one win against Lopez, but Lopez, yeah. what a CV. Yeah. Four times world champion, two times silver medals at the championships. So. Uh, and the London Olympic uh, fifth, uh, three times Olympic, two times Olympian champion, two times Olympic champion. So let's see what uh, he's going to do here. And Lopez, such a formidable figure, the big man in blue. So they've got one win against each other each. Kyla won in Istanbul. <laughs> Lopez returned the favour in the semi-final of the London Olympic Games on the way to his second goal. But just monstrous men here, it's a, Daniel. It's a second revenge. It's Absolutely. A, la belle, we say in French. La I don't belle. know in English. Uh, when you won, won, won. Then after that, you have the, the, the final. Yep, this is the decider. <laughs> who will take the decision. But Lopez, such a relaxed style, Daniel. He doesn't really get too flustered. Or two pushed around, but Kyle up, as we said, four times European champion and indeed a world champion in his own right. So he's going to have to produce something special though, because Lopez looks in the mood. Just using his legs there to get into position. Fingers, referee, fingers. On the blind side of the referee. Three steps in that time, Lopez looking as if he's going to be one for passivity. Trying to be more aggressive now, pushing Kyle up back. He's using his uh, gabarit, his, uh, you know, his uh, morphology to, to take advantage on Kyle. And of course, sometimes when you see the men of this size, you think, oh, well, it's just power, it's just strength. It's clearly not. They've obviously got a lot of technique as well. It's, it's because they are, they are both uh, good technicians, so it's difficult to, uh, to find uh, the way to, to, to have a weakness on the opponent. So they are on so high, so high level. And the, the image doesn't deserve it. It's the, it's the Korean coach here, or good coach in Cuba, in Greco. Let's see what Lopez will do on the floor. Maybe some spectacular lift to throw or gut wrench. He's got a good hold of Kyle up. He went a bit he's, previous though. He stole the start, as we say in uh, sprint in uh, track and field. And in swimming too, you know, they get eliminated if they stole the start. <laughs> but Lopez just saying, okay, I'll take a break if you want me to. <laughs> Step back, reobserve, re engage. Kyle yeah, up tries okay. to escape. Now, yeah. Wow. Kyle up caught in the headlights there, was listening for the whistle. He's Lopez wasn't. He's in position. He's, he's climbing on the He's floor. got his feet up, the big oh, man oh, from Cuba. Oh, that time, one one. Will he go for another one? Yeah. He will indeed. Two points. Now ahead. He go from from hand to hand. Watching the coach. Lessening the coach. These coach have a lot of experience. Lopez has that advantage now. Can Kyle get himself back into this one? And the Turk just trying to lean on Kyle, just a little bit stuck in the middle here, literally in the middle of the mat. This is the World Championship heavyweight final, the 130 kilogram class. Now, you know, the the Cuban uh, will not uh, take any risk. Two points in heavy weight class is uh, two very big points. <laughs> it's a big advantage for 
the man from Havana in blue. He's having a good time at the moment, certainly the Cuban. <coughs> Kayop just running out of ideas and running out of time in this opening period. It's been all about Lopez. It looks that uh, he don't have enough power to uh, to move uh, the Cuban. It's not a lack of effort. It's just how do you move the man mountain yeah. that is Lopez? And he's not uh, he's not uh, destabilizing him on his uh, support on his you know on his feet. You see the the work of uh, Cuban for the first uh, guard range one side, then. On the left side, then after come back on the, on the right side. Well, Riza Kailab is going to have to try and produce something special. We know that he's won the worlds before the Turk. He won it in his home city of Istanbul. He's out of luck at the moment, though. The big man Lopez. And he can kai up, look small. And Mian Lopez just uh, will just wait now. Uh, we we'll let uh, the Turkish uh, in red to take the risk. Let's see if he's able to take any risk. Well, he's but certainly the, trying to. He is trying, but you know the, we can't see any uh, any any way to open the the fence that the stance of the Cuban. You know is really controlling the the the, the belt and the upper body controls. On the tie-ups, always grabbing the fingers at the beginning, always. That's why there are a lot of bandage on the fingers, by the way. <laughs> Lopez, as you said, happy for the clock to run down. The referee, however, is yeah. not. Caution, no. So... Grabbing the fingers. Oh, the referee asked uh, to the Turkish if he wants to have a part there at action or stand up. And uh, Heylap uh, chose to stay stand up. And what does that indicate to you? He doesn't think that he can lift Lopez? No, that's it, yes. He's, uh, he, he knows that it will be a uh, wasted time uh, to, to go on the floor. And uh, second time passive again now. Uh, Kyle up just walking around the mat here, no, no, looking he for inspiration no, and energy. Now you want him to stand up, uh, Pater. Now you want him in the Pater position. Let's see if he'll but try looking. something. We didn't saw that much Olympic lift here. We saw just a guard wrench, a type of guard wrench, or lift and half to place. He's got a hold, Kyle, but he looks absolutely exhausted. He's got both feet up. He's got the position. Can he get? Oh, you see the spin of the. Uh, yeah, the, the quick feet. Yes, yes, Has yes. he got it? Almost. No. <laughs> close though. He that had to get. Close, had close. to get the momentum. He, he had a good switch from one side to the other side. Lift him. Trying for it. Falling his bump. Well, he falls no. to the mat, and you can see there, Daniel. It was just a question of raw power. He just couldn't generate. He, he, he almost turned it. Had the momentum. Yeah. Just couldn't get the turn in the end. But it's not a question of momentum at the time. It's a question of stamina in a good place uh, to have the good leverage. Because leverage is very important. Wrestling is a, is a demonstration of biomechanics, particularly the Greco. Particularly the Greco. It's more application of biomechanics principles. And here, if you have the good point to push, a good point to, p to pivot, to rotate. It works. Lopez is the master at the moment. So the, the coach uh, tell him, no, no, come on. Move around, move around, but, uh, wait for it. Well, Mayan Lopez only has a little bit longer to wait because, as we've said, four times world champion, very much on the verge here of making that world title <laughs> number five. Yes, easy. Kyle's trying, but He's Lopez trying. is evading, even has a quick look at the clock there. Let's say there's no way to, uh, to uh, de destabilize the Cuban. He's uh, so steady, so secure on his uh, defense, and now it's almost an impossible mission. Well, it is indeed. Kyle gave it all he had. It will be silver for Turkey. 
but another gold medal. Mayan Lopez, five times world champion. He was made to work for it though, Daniel. He had to try, certainly. A close score, Kayal. Uh, Kayal tried, you know, on the floor. It was a beautiful move. Just miss. Uh, if he turned him, you know, it would be... A different, different story. Yeah, yeah. 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 Well, they've shared one victory each previously. Kayal won in Turkey, Lopez won in London. But it's now 2-1 in the series of the heavyweight classic here. Mayan Lopez. Smile on the face. Congratulations by your uh, partners, coaches. Well, he's the archetypal heavyweight, the perfect physical strength and skill. It's a deception, disappointment on the side of the, on the corner, I will say, of the Turkish team. You will see the two points, two times one point of Lopez. One on the left, one on the right. Well executed and not that much resistance from the Turkish, from Kayab. And, and satisfaction on the face of the new, uh, new world champion for the fifth time. Yeah, exactly. <laughs>